Okay, we have six North Island brown kiwis here. Those, that's the only species you will actually find outside of New Zealand. They're very bizarre, very unbird-like as far as birds go. They evolved in a very isolated uh, environment. And as such, they, they evolved to have a lot of uh, characteristics that you don't see in other birds. They have, they have a lot of mammal-like characteristics. Within New Zealand, it, at one point, prior to the arrival of humans, there was really only birds found there. There was only three mammal species. Those were all three bats. Once humans arrived, uh, it was about 700 years ago, they started introducing a lot of non-native species that had a major impact of, on all of the native uh, fauna there. In particular with the kiwis, there's you know, stoats, which is a small European weasel, cats, dogs, and you know, various other you know, introduced animals. It's absolutely critical to learn as much about some of these species prior to them getting down to such critically low numbers that there are none left in the wild uh, because in that situation once you bring them into captivity you have no means of studying them in the wild and if it's a species that hasn't been managed in captivity before all the husbandry aspects and breeding has not been worked out yet so you're just starting from scratch you know, not knowing anything about their natural biology in the wild really doesn't help you at all for managing them in captivity.